Hello there and welcome back to another episode in our series. So let's go through quickly what we are going to do today. So so yeah, the dam was uh, done in the last episode and that's allowing us to keep this area a bit more greener during the droughts. The current one has another uh, just under two days left and uh, we're doing pretty good so far. I mean, the water levels are uh, running a little bit lower, but otherwise things seem to be going pretty well. So our focus for this episode is to try and expand into the back areas around this, uh, yeah, just the backside of our village. And I was thinking, well, I do want to have this area a bit more greener as well. So what I'm thinking is we're going to build some, well, we are already building those dams in here and a couple of levees as well. And uh, we'll expand our safe zone a little bit. As soon as this area is blocked, we shall, well, we're halfway there. We'll be able to raise the water level by one, as long as the droughts don't go uh, over 10 days, of course. And then we're going to have to plan another another section of a dam right about here. Uh, they just do have to yeah, do this uh, set of stairs in there. Okay, so this one's almost complete. We'll uh, keep it at the two times the speed. I think in the last episode, what I mentioned, or at least I used it as an example, was to do a forestry and woodwork station here. Uh, I've kind of put some thought into this and I've changed my mind. I think we want the farms to go into this area and uh, the um, the forestry uh, right about there actually because once we expand onto this hillside over here I think we want the, uh, the, the blanks, the gears and everything else to have a slightly shorter distance to reach other places as well. I mean the smartest uh, thing would be to do it maybe somewhere in the middle, but then again, the logs will be very far. It's not very flat land over here. Uh, yeah, so it's it's going to go right about here somewhere. And for that, we are going to have to expand the roads a little bit. I thought I removed these sections already. Maybe I did not. Oh, you can't reach there. Uh, you know what? It's fine. It's just a couple of trees. We can take them out. Uh, is this them done? No. A little bit more. Well, it's night time, so we'll... Um, make it go a little bit quicker now beaver population we got a spare beaver right now but <laughs> i think we're gonna have to expand this even further oh water is only 12 what is going on okay so you maybe let's have this constructed first is anyone okay there we go so we can have another beaver here extra water coming in and these two should definitely sustain our population i mean it's only 20 but yeah, seems like um, two are needed for about 20 beavers, so 1 to 10 ratio. Okay, uh, interesting. Uh, right, moving on. Yep, so we're going to have to expand our population. And for that, what I was thinking, uh, let's just do a few houses. Um, <laughs> I guess we can do them right about here actually as well. Let's just put a couple down. Okay, you'll be connected as well. Very nice and easy. And... Uh, Oh, you've completed that one. Okay, you're next. Uh, plenty of logs in the storage, and there's a few maples that are complete as well. We even have to, had to build another log pile over here. And uh, you're not really going very well, are you? Oh, that's okay. Well, the drought has also ended, so that's um, that's beautiful. Now, just one, one small beer here, and I think I've realized as well, I haven't done much about the well-being. So perhaps that's something we'll do here as well. So, 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 let's see. Yep, let's do one campfire. And it would be nice and lovely to have some rooftop terraces here. Oh, that means we're going to have to climb up, aren't we? Yep, set of stairs in here. And do we want to open another platform? Hmm, it would be cheaper, right? How many science points is it? 150, that's fine. That's okay, and we'll just have a couple of... Oh, I could have done it. Oh, never mind. I, I, I was thinking maybe I could have done the spiral staircases. Oh, yeah, it would have been cheaper. Uh, that's fine. That's okay. We'll uh, get those science points back in no time. You're done as well. Okay, that's fantastic. How about the last levy in there? Highest priority. We still have loads of logs. Hmm. No. Let's have these houses done first so we can start having more baby beavers. 
And what else do we need? Oh, showers would be cool. Wet fur. Only 50 points, so maybe a couple of these. Oh, I remember. Yes, we are going to build another uh, dam right about here as well, just to expand our territory a little bit. But this one's going to take uh, a ton of logs. So what I'm thinking, you could be the, the lowest priority, right? Okay, there we go. And these ones... And we just need one more right about here. Let's give you also the lowest priority. Okay, so if the beavers have nothing else to do, they can start constructing at this zone in here. Uh, actually, I think I've just noticed, yeah, they have already completed most of it. So that's uh, that's awesome. Might even be able to complete this section before the, before the drought starts. Okay, so we've got a campfire now. That's going to... Well, it's still only seven, but I'm sure it's going to go up in no time. Why don't we actually take a look? Wet fur, seven. Uh, everything else is pretty good. And maybe it's time we do some different foods as well. I mean, we've got a couple, but it seems our farmers can't keep up with... Ah, uh, yeah. Okay, we're going to need some more farms. Well, that should be easy. Oh, but we don't have beavers. Oh. Oh. Of course. Okay, speed up the time. What are the beavers doing right now? I'm hoping they'll, they will clean up more of this space very quickly. Oh yeah, you're going to need those stairs to be done as well, right? So, slightly high priority over there. You're still not doing anything. Okay. Um, <laughs> how about we just move you further down? Alright, and there's our first rooftop terrace done. Uh, we still haven't got a much more well-being points, but that's uh, that's okay. I was hoping it's going to go up a slightly bit quicker, but oh well. Uh, right, so wet fur. How shall we do it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> let's hide the water real quick. And I think um, what would be smart, I hope it would be smart, maybe we do one right about, right about here. Yeah, that looks good. Oh, wait a second. It goes a few levels down, doesn't it? Let's uh, test out this side. And whilst we add it, let's... Um, just a quick test. Oh, right. So you can reach all the way down. Interesting. Uh, so how about we pause you? Yep. Let's just do one for the time being. And speed up the time. What are you going to take? One blank. That's fine. And a few logs as well. Not a biggie. Okay. Uh, road almost through. And... Oh, there's already another one of you here. Okay, here we go. Uh, yep. Yeah, so, going to put down a couple more houses just to boost our population. Because we are going to need tons of workers. Yeah, I can't wait to get to... Get to the columns as well and give those guys a... Uh, quick test. So I'm assuming that most people that have gone the columns way, I heard that in update 3, they're going to call it, they're going to rename the columns to bots as well. So I, yeah, I did just see the the update 3 notes, which uh, seems pretty interesting. They're going to rework the warehouses uh, a little bit as well to make it a bit easier and more, yeah, I guess more easily understandable, I guess. Even myself and quite a lot of other players as well. It seems uh, the um, the way the system and the storages work right now isn't isn't very intuitive. Let's let's put it that way. Okay, um, there we go. Another road. How far can we reach here? Oh, okay. We still have to clear a bit more space here, right? Oh, there we go. We're almost through. Yeah. So this is a pretty good spot in here. We got plenty of logs and planks. So let's. Uh, Let's build one of those forests here. Oh, there's a drought coming. Three more days. Uh, how can we have three buildings that are flooded? One... Oh. Oh, that's fine. Because we have these ones here as well. I was a little worried if uh, if we messed up the, the water situation again. Um, I do need this to be gone as well. Okay, here we go. Here's a, another beaver that's helping us take care of it. And since uh, you don't really have anything to do, let's take you out. And uh, we're not going to make this pretty. We're just going to make it efficient for the time being. I don't quite know the exact layout we want to go with in the future here. So it sort of makes it easy, I guess, in a way. 
Let's just build as many many maples as we can, or plant, I mean. We're not building them. Okay. Uh, this looks good. I'm happy. Uh, we'll connect you up with the roads as well, and uh, there's just so many flowers here. Gonna have to tidy this area up eventually as well. Okay, this is looking better. We got seven seven kids in the in the colony, and I think we're gonna not gonna stop there. Let's do another house. Would be lovely to have another what's it called like a rooftop terrace here as well, but seems it's not. It's fine. Okay, so the shower is done. That's cool. Well-being's gone up to eight. Um, what else can we do very easily? Oh, a little shrine for these beavers. Why not? Let's do a couple since we do have the space in here. They do take a lot of logs though. 24 something this tiny. Well, that's a little odd. And medical beds. Oh, interesting. Um, oh, we got a healer as well, but we need metal for those. Oh dear, okay. Fine. Uh, for this section here, right, a couple more things to mention. Uh, do you know what? It's night time right now. So why don't we skip this and then we talk about a little bit about our layout and what, what we want to do with this area. All right, here we go. Um, actually, before we jump into this area, I do not want to forget that we also need to do this in here. I think two should be sufficient, right? Yeah, that should be good. So we'll give you the right priorities as well. Uh, there we go. And I'm um, hoping they can build this before the drought starts. Yeah, let's do this one here. They can still walk through and reach all of these. Okay, happy days. This area here, as soon as the beavers have finished constructing the dam on the other side, we shall unlock this area and... Um, since it's going to be farms, but half of this area, or maybe a little less than a half, is not very usable. So I was thinking, um, well, we're going to have to bring some water here, which means we need to flood some kind of a zone. I mean, we could always, you know, dynamite in and just cut in here, which probably would be more sensible and easy. But why make it easy if we could make it more difficult? Right, and to do that... Uh, I was thinking to put levees just around the edge over here. Go all the way right about here as well. Yeah, it's starting to sound a little ridiculous as I, as I speak about it or talk about it. Uh, but I'm thinking maybe we levy this uh, whole zone one level higher. And then, um, yeah, raise the water level on this side. And then let the water that's coming from the other side of the waterfall sort of flow through to the edge of the map in here and then through the canal wraps around this little mountain or a hill in here and goes all the way this side that would be cool right i don't know maybe it's easier to get the dynamites or the explosives and just dig in but um well that's okay we'll start small with a couple of farms in here and then um because we got loads of logs as well and i think once this is online we should be pretty good, right? So, tons of logs. Yeah. Or at least potentially. Yeah, I, I think we could probably get rid of all these plants in here as well. There you go. And we'll just we'll plant as many maples in here as we can. Okay. Have you already... Oh, no. I forgot. Nothing to do in range. What, what do you mean? Well, if you got nothing to do, why don't you go and work elsewhere? Wait, maybe we do need those logs. No. <laughs> Actually, yeah. Why don't you start just harvesting anything you can in this area? Yeah, that's fine for now. All right, beavers. Are we constructing? Yes, we are. Uh, if we could have... Mm, no, we don't have enough time. 12, 8. Actually, it would be quicker and easier if we just do levees in here. Yeah. Okay, okay, we'll pause you. You're the highest priority. Ooh, 0 0.7 days. Do we think we'll have enough time? Hmm. There's four logs in here. One, two, three, four. 0 0.6 days. Okay, it's almost evening. 0 0.3 days left. Uh, they were about to go to sleep, but I really want this done. There's only two of them left. This one has three... Will they be able to carry them quick enough? 
Okay, here we go. Give you the highest priority. You are slightly higher as well. What happened with you? You are broken teeth. Okay. That's okay. Go and see a dentist. They'll fix you right up. Okay, 0 0.3. This is almost done. You're next. We might be able to complete it. Okay, quick, quick, quick. Um, what this means is... I should be able to open you up and let some more water flow through, I think. Yeah. Okay, so four left. We have six in here. Eight, ten. And you're gonna grab the last twelve. Or two, I mean. Where has he gone? I hope he went to grab some more logs. Let's see. Oh, these are the last two. Okay, beautiful. Now we do have to demolish this as well, right? It's too far. No. No, 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 no. Oh, dear. What about this one? Okay, we can reach this one, it seems. Is anyone coming? No, this one's too far as well. What do you mean? Oh, no, it's all good now. Cancel you. And everyone, please go to sleep. You must be really tired. Okay, there we go. Hopefully we get a little bit more water in here. No, the drought has started. Well, actually... Oh, yeah. The waterfall's already stopped, so... Um, <laughs> 12 days. That's quite a long time, actually. Well, this is just gonna... Oh... Uh, maybe it wasn't such a good idea. Yeah, now it's gonna dry... Well, it's gonna dry up anyways, but it's gonna dry up quicker. Which means, well, we're not really growing much in here, so that's okay. Um, all these trees, well, they're not gonna grow. Anyways, that's alright. Uh, what we shall do, since this is going to be uh, more like a farming area, I think it's time to get rid of all this stuff in here. We'll uh, st start from a clean page, I think. That's probably easier. Yeah, let's uh, take you all out. Okay, remove all these. Oh, this uh, area here is pretty clean now as well. Yeah, so we can definitely have some more beavers again. We've got two bumps in here, but is this going to be enough? Probably not. What I'd like to do is, as soon as we get maybe halfway through, we'll do some more bumps in here, because it, all this water here, uh, yeah, we can definitely use up as much as we want from here. And this side, no, this side we don't want to really reduce the water level, so that's okay. Okay, yeah. Lots of things to do. Let's do a couple more houses. Hopefully these beavers grow up uh, very quickly. Okay. Here we go. Is that going to connect both houses? Yes, it is. Yeah, it's not looking very pretty just yet, but that's okay. I think we're going to beautify this colony a little bit later. Maybe next or the episode after this one. Because right now I just want to reach the materials that we need for some bigger buildings as quick as we can. Okay, so you can probably be on post. And here we're going to climb up. Okay, I do want to access these sections here as well. So, oh, okay, yeah, that's going to be a bit more trickier than I thought. How about we go back a little bit? All right, so this looks a little bit better. Yep, there we go. Now, oh, you're paused. Okay, let's unpause you. There's a few more trees we can cut down now. And just to get it going a little bit quicker... Uh, should we do a farm? Oh, there's trees everywhere in the way. Right by the road would be lovely. Well, it's night time again, so we'll let the beavers cut down a couple of trees. Uh, tomorrow, I suppose. Or we could just demolish them. No, it, it's fine. I'm a little, little impatient, I think. Yeah, I do want to start. No, never mind. Okay. So yeah, we'll get this area cleaned up. And once it's done, then uh, we'll, we'll stick down the farms as well. What's happening here? Okay, so they're... I think they have been clearing up quite a bit of this space, which is lovely. And I should quickly fill this area with as many maples as I can. Okay, and you're busy planting over there. Okay, so this side is fantastic. This one... Okay, we're slowly, slowly getting there. How about you remove all this stuff from here as well? Or as many as you can, at least. Right, so now that we have access to the upper area, 
I think it's time to start removing some of that metal from here. Alright, and our happiness has gone up to level 10, well, back to 9 now. Uh, so, what are some of the other ways how we could increase this? I guess, uh, let's have a look at well-being real quick. Medical bed would be lovely, although we don't have the medicine for it. Uh, little goopy temple would be a nice one. That takes quite a lot of logs. I mean, we, I think we're going to be okay with logs very, very soon. Oh, uh, healer we can't do. These are getting slightly expensive as well. Yeah, I think it's going to have to be food to make them a little bit happier. And it seems, I think we have a space in here, don't we? Oh, we don't. All right, here we go. We've got nine days left. And um, since the log storages are full, we're going to have to build another quick uh, log pile in here as well. I'm not sure what the beavers are doing. Oh, they are building that levee wall over there. So what I'm thinking is let's try and clean up this space here so we can start constructing some other things. Yep, pretty much everything's going to go. Um, they might not be able to reach all of this area, but that's okay. And uh, what I'm thinking, maybe we do a road that... Yeah, that could be good. So let's uh, cut through with the road right about here. And as soon as these trees are cut down, which might not happen anytime soon. Uh, but that's where I think we're going to put this road through. Yep, that's uh, that looks good to me. And maybe we need another logger over here. Another lumberjack. Okay, we'll leave you to it. Um, <laughs> right, so now that we have this area a bit more free in here, let's do a farm, kind of like a temporary farm, right about there. And what we shall nothing to do in range. Oh, yep, that's okay. Uh, I think the first thing we'll do here, a bit of sunflowers, uh, wheat. Oh, yeah, could start making some bread, which means we need some... Electricity, I believe. Yep, we're gonna need some power. Do you know what? Maybe we uh, speed this process up a little bit since... Um, yeah, there's a lot of maples. How about you go through here? And actually, we are gonna need another forester in here as well. So, I just realized I haven't really quite told you what I'm planning with this uh, section here. So, I wanna cut this road through. And... I'm thinking we do uh, like a little chestnut farm in here, but also not just a box of chestnuts, but we'll have some campfires uh, spread out along the uh, the middle here as well. Uh, so that would be could be pretty lovely. And what would be cool as well is maybe if we get a road going right about here. Okay, through here, and they'll crossover right about there I think that looks good this zone is almost free as well they might not be able to reach everything no they will that's okay then let's see well-being what's happening wet fur oh that's one of the lowest ones and oh wait what's going on with the food can you do carrots yes please I think we might have a small problem uh, so, we don't have a lot of potatoes. Oh yeah, we just don't have uh, enough farmers, but that is uh, that is about to change. So, carrot is another one. For the time being, plant as... Oh. Okay, here we go. Plant as many as you can. And then what I'll do is I'll just go around the area and tidy this up a little bit. So, another five days left till the drought is over. I've decided to put down another quick temporary farm in here because our food is uh, looking yeah it's looking very sad right now uh, we do have some potatoes and plenty of carrots in here we just need enough hands to uh, get it off the fields and into our uh, storages or or the grill over here okay so that's uh it's starting to go pretty well I want to say uh, yeah kind of okay and this side as well, they've uh, cleared up quite a quite a large area actually. So what we'll do is let's uh, plant a few more sunflowers here, and a couple of carrots will go in any anytime soon as well. Okay, here's a few more. 
Someone is injured. Oh, I think we're gonna need some medical beds now, don't we? Yep, so... How about we unlock at least one and build at least... Well, yeah, we can only unlock one, but we'll build two of them here. This means we are gonna have to start producing metal to build the healer hut as well. Oh yeah, there is definitely a lot to do, and here goes the last of the water, which means all these plants are now... Well, they're pretty much dead, aren't they? Um, that's okay. It's, uh, it's not okay, of course, but um, I guess we're just gonna have to try and survive for for a bit longer. Okay. Um, <laughs> what can we do? Uh, I think what we can and shall do, we have some blueberries there, right? Yes. Okay, if we get this built real, real quick, we can uh, start farming them and therefore probably keep those beavers alive for another three days until everything is fertile again. But I think with uh, that being said, we've uh, yeah made the foundation for our... Uh, lumber and woodwork district. Here's gonna be our farming area. Well, not really a district. Well, maybe actually. I think it's quite far, isn't it? Yep, it's pretty far. So yeah, another district uh, going there. Hopefully we don't have to build uh, a third district in this side, but who knows? We'll see. Anyways, we got the foundation in place. Everything's pretty dry, but the drought is going to be over in, in about three days. But yeah, we'll carry on building in the next episode. In the meanwhile, thank you so much for watching. Thanks for those lovely comments. And I'll see you in the next episode.